Hello and welcome to episode 28 of Bobo's Scrub Arty Records. <laughs> Today I'm going to stick with the tier 10s for a little bit and going to start off in the T92. This is still patch 9.2. This is the last episode of patch 9.2. I expect 9.3 will be out when this episode comes out. So sorry I'm a little bit behind. I don't have too much time on my hands to be able to record them, uh, to record these episodes, so I tend to do six every other Friday or Saturday, depending on what gigs I have and things, so that does mean I'm a little bit behind. It also means that I've had three or four really good replays sent to me from a couple of the guys on the forum, I've had some really good response from them, and it's made me really happy, I'm really pleased. I've looked through those games and wow it's really cool so I'm gonna try and make an episode up of of some replays of of some other people which would be really really nice I will do that I might actually it might already be up you never know uh, at the moment I'm not really sure so yeah I'm gonna do that and I might try and do some replays of my own it does take a little while though I um I have found that it's it takes a lot longer Let's get this show to on the road. go through and record them all and everything. And I'm not brilliant at all this kind of malarkey. I'm still learning, so you'll have to bear with me on that kind of thing. I do really want to do it though, and I'm me and my other half are in the process of organising our wedding, so that's kind of taking up a little bit of priority. And obviously, I, I gig quite a bit and I work full time, so. My time is very limited, but I enjoy doing this. This is like a nice relaxing thing for me. So, yeah, anyway, to this match, talking random stuff. That tortoise might be AFK. Oh, he's just heading for a thing. So, 257 heavy. Tortoise is back. I think I will tortoise first. And let's just wait for the same time. I really wish it was a little better, but patience and all that. I'm not sure if that was mine or that was mine, but yeah. Okay, let's see if we can help out up here. So I've got this bit covered and we can get over to here. So it's interesting. Can't get over this rock. I've not sat over here before. So this is kind of a a learning thing for me. Trying to work out where the good spots are since this map was reworked and this hill up the top here was taken away. It's made for a lot more interesting things potentially. Nice, that was random. I think it going wide actually worked out for me. So that's kind of cool. Might move forward a little bit just in case the artillery spotted where I was sat. Let's keep an eye on that I can still get around here. That's good. Still seem keen on pushing around this corner, which is nice. It might give us the potential to get another shell off over in this direction. And there's a mouse with no end. <laughs> I think it might be worth us trying to hit this guy. He's just going to pushy push push. Wow, is that my shell over there? Bloody hell. Okay, so these are going long. I need to remember to, I need to aim slightly short. So, we're still in a good spot, we shouldn't panic, we are being, we are potentially being overrun slightly here. Let's wait for this, yeah, we're reloading, let's just 
just keep an eye. Oh, typical. Typical. Can we get any shots at these guys? Yeah. So maybe it is still better for to sit over. I used to sit over the eastern side. And kind of shoot across. Let's try and help this guy out a little bit. if we did hit that tortoise or not. We could have done. I don't really know. So. Dum be dum dum. Be dum be dum. Be dum be dum be dum be dum. Am I gonna get reloaded in time? Am I gonna get reloaded in time? Probably not. Probably not. Super. Just. We're dead for it. Everyone get out. I think we'll leave that there then, hey? Yeah. So sticking with the tier ten games. We're gonna go into tier nine. <laughs> <sighs> right yo. Erlenberg with a sixty eight percent chance to win. This is a standard battle. Tier ten game. See? Said we're sticking with the tier 10 games. And. Let's get this show on the road. I think I'm gonna do. What, you know. Some people do, I guess. Is I'm gonna try and stay here. Just for the moment. I'm not gonna sit near the bushes though, because that's a little bit too obvious. And. It's gonna take a little peek. See if we can see any. Destructo going on. There's a tree down. Boop. And then we will go over here. Have to make sure that I move. And there's a lerva. And he stopped. And there's the IS7. Dragon. Boom. Really long. Really, 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 really long. Why was that? Was I not aimed in all the way? Probably. Okay. That's interesting. That's very interesting. So, let's see my 46 pound. Looks like he was up here. Let's keep an eye. Let's see if we could potentially get a shot on him. Here's that was close. Well, we tracked him at least. Let's just move over a little bit. And we'll have some tank destroyers on the hill. Ball sink coming up on the side there, and that eastern flank looks pretty dodgy. I think after this reload, it might be worth us. Checking over that side of things. That was close. Okay, there's something. So. Let's just uh, have a look at what's going on over this way. Just in case he. I don't know who just in case he is. Oh. Bad jokes from Bobo. Da 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 da. Bad jokes. He has bad jokes. Dum 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 dum. I got 
Action problem. Enemy armor is destroyed. Oh, that was odd. That was very strange. I wonder if that recorded. Hmm. Interesting. I guess that helped. It says that 1,950 damage. So yeah, must have hit him in the bum. Right, let's get the hell out of dodge. This is going to be a good plan. And try and move around with all those heavies and stuff. So, yes. This thing is a little bit more nimble. I'm actually going to get a gun uh, gold round just for the next one in case we need something big and chunky. Looks like these guys are coming back. I'm not going to let that AMX try and hit me. Sit over here. And there's the two. It's probably more important that we fire upon these guys. Let's wait for the same time to come all the way in. And critical hit. It's nice. These guys are screwed now. Yep, I'm not going to get loaded in time. So, it's not bad though. Not bad at all. Nice. So here's the result from the T92. We lost money again. Don't. Oh. But never mind, it's bug all damage, that's why. Oh, terrible, 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 terrible. But this one was nice. Nice. This was uh, 3,319 damage. Not bad, not bad. Made a bit of money. So, yeah. Does that mean we've actually made a little bit of money this time? Possibly. Didn't make any money on that one, but made some on this one. Tiny, 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 tiny bit. T tiny, tiny. Okie dokie. So, let's do another tier 9. Possibly going to be a tier 10 game. Give some more XP to this crew. I think we have some missions this weekend that might help us out a little bit with the crew. Is that destroy a German vehicle? At least one. Get a bit more experience. Hmm. Seems like I have to be in an American vehicle to do that. Interesting. Okie dokie. Well, maybe we should have a change of plan then. Destroy a US vehicle in one of these. I have all of those. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Might go out in the PZ4 then. Yeah, haven't used the PZ4 for a very long time. This is, uh, wow, yeah, it's back when I didn't really know what to do with the crew skills. So, hmm, bear with me a moment. I might just have a fiddle with the crew. Okie dokie, so I'm back. What I ended up doing. Uh, so I was having to think about it and repairs is probably the best option for a tier 5 medium and because I don't really want to uh, spend too much more money on this I think what I've done is I've picked 6 cents for the commander I know it's not going to do any have any effect until he reaches 100% but I'm not really going to be retraining them again and I don't really want to get rid of this so I'm willing to just let it be um, yeah so we're going to do that and yeah let's go give it a go i'm running the um the little 10.5 kwk l28 i could run the l48 but i like this little derpy gun i think maybe because i'm 
artillery player primarily kind of I like my high explosive shells I'm running some uh, armor piercing ones as well I could get some of the anti-tank ones I think maybe we could run four of those yeah, I think we'll run four of those. Cool. Yeah. So, let's go give it a go. So, uh, we've been very lucky. We've got a tier five match. 68% chance to win. And Pearl River. Is it Pearl River? Yes, the one that I can never pronounce and end up having to do it three or four times. So, yes. Like I said, the last time I played this tank, it didn't even have these little side pieces on, so I have no idea it. how it's going to be. Um, and I think I might head towards the middle to begin with and see if we can be fairly aggressive. Dumpty dumpty dum. I do like the look of this little tank. It's, it's really lovely. I've got a, I've got a funny feeling. I, I don't live too far from Bovington Tank Museum, and I'm pretty sure they've got something similar to this down there. And they look really really awesome in 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 the flesh, or in in the armour, as it were. So, oh, just stop, silly moves. Down. Oh, the Nemesis, the M4. Ooh. Let's see if we can get a shot. Das muss wehtun. Kette wurde getroffen. Sie kann jeden Moment reißen. It's the Bishop. Let's try not to stay too still. This is a bit crowded over this way, you know. And the Bishop's managed to take one of them out. Shot. See if we can get round on this guy. Nice. Don't know that the bishop can get me here, so that's good. Let's just see if we can. Oh dear, this is not, not a good place to be. Let's see if we can just poke out that little bit. And the bishop got me! Hey. <laughs> oh dear, that's just what we thought was going to happen, wasn't it? Oh dear. Right, yo. I think just to finish off this episode, we'll go out in the, uh, the Super Pershing and see what happens mm, probably not good but <sighs> so we're on Manilovka it's a tier 8 game which is nice because we're in a tier 8 and it's an encounter battle so I think as long as I do kind of well then at least we get a little bit of money, you know, this is a premium tank and a little bit of cash that would be nice towards the object so I'm Time to roll out. very good with this tank at all so I'm going to head up over the hill and try and be fairly aggressive hopefully people will follow me looks like it, it's good I'm not going to hang about because I'm fairly slow. So, looks like we have a T34, 85 and a T29 headed up. And that IS is running through. So 
That's interesting. Don't know if I've been spotted yet. Again, this crew is... I think it's an M7 crew. I don't know. Now, am I being pretty silly to push up on my own? Probably. Is that tiger following me? Good, the tiger's following me. That's cool. There's one artillery. It's an M44. Don't think I ever used the M44. I was way past that before. Um, before uh, they came into existence. So see what we can see up here. Penetration. Let's keep pushing. It's a Hellcat 2. Okie dokie. This is probably going to end well from my point of view. He's Hold down. And he's firing at me pretty good, so it's probably a good idea to pull back slightly. So if we can get a shot on the sky. Go for the cupola. to bounce some shots. That's kind of good. We're and for it. Everyone get out. So pushing up that way at least I managed to hold them back a little bit. And yeah I probably shouldn't have pushed too far. I think maybe if I'd have stayed back, but then it would have given them better positions. So, I think maybe if I had a little bit of backup that would have helped. Still, that's my mistake. I should have probably stayed a little bit further back. Never mind. We'll leave that there. Okie dokie. So, the PZ4 was a defeat in the end. 68% chance to win that was, so it just shows that, you know... XVM isn't everything. But we didn't make a loss. Did a little bit of damage. <laughs> Pretty terrible, really. And this is the Super Pershing's results. 1,200 damage. It's a defeat again. We just got completely wiped out. So I didn't even get any kills or anything. I did what I could. I think I pushed too hard and it was silly me getting caught there. I'm fairly slow. You know, the the Super Pershing is better at the the kind of the medium to long range combat and I think it was just a bit too close. And the T thirty four is pretty strong. Just yeah, wasted some <sighs> Never mind. Well, I hope you've enjoyed this episode. Sorry for all the losses. And, uh, yeah, I will see you in the next one.